So you wanna get better at crossing over. Here are our tricks on how to do that. And the first is extremely counterintuitive. We're gonna retitle the cross over from the cross over to the cross under. And although for years and years it's been taught as the cross over, I think that language leads people to have the wrong mechanics. So you see a lot of young players getting taught, oh, crossing over is about crossing over. It's about the leg that's on the outside of the turn crossing over. Well, that actually ends up giving you a little bit funky mechanics and it's a little bit different to how the best crossoverers or cross underers like McDavid and McKinnon actually work. So what they actually focus on is more the cross under. The cross under leg is more what they're moving. So you can see I'm barely moving here my outside leg that I'm really focused on just crossing under here. So if you want to get better at crossovers, you don't actually want to cross over. You actually want to focus on your cross under. So retitling it, reframing it, shifting that language allows you to shift your mechanics and focus on different things. And that's something that we go over in the downhill skating system is what's the language of cues that coaches can give you so that you can access more mechanics to skate more like McKinnon and McDavid and less like, I don't know, an awkward beginner. So that's the main coaching tip for today to improve your crossovers is go from a crossover cue, which is even though it's common, it's still kind of awkward to more of a cross under where I focus more on the lower under leg. There's all sorts of mechanics to that, which we can get into in depth in the downhill skating system on how you can use gravity, centripetal force, all these things to go even faster. But that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching and I hope this is helpful.